Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Real Loose Adventures. Um, this episode we're going to be uh, filming for the Cooktown Hog Hunt. So it's the day before the hog hunt, so we're just packing some gear, getting ready to go. We're going to be heading up to a station that's just renowned for a lot of big pigs and a lot of numbers. We've been up there before and got 30 or 40 pigs for a weekend, so pretty keen, just itching to go. So tomorrow morning we're going to chuck the dogs in the back and load up the quads and get into it so stay tuned for a bit of action hopefully what do you reckon my dog <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon eh? oh yeah the slide eh? <laughs> gotta hit a can of spots and wipe them blazes wait 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 <laughs> You got a big hook. Blaze, Blaze, come! Blaze! Blaze! Blaze, come! Come! Blaze, come! 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 Drag him, drag him! Blaze, Blaze, here! Blaze! Just uh, wandering to another swamp. The dogs have just taken off, so hopefully they don't cut me short here. But I thought I'd just explain uh, that last clip you would have just seen of me pulling the pig out of a dam and the dogs on it. And you're probably wondering why I was pulling that pig out so quick and yelling at Connor to come give me a hand. Because only three weeks before that, that same dam, we uh, went up there to do a bit of a scope out mission for the pig comp and see how many pigs were getting around. And, we drove up on the dam and I was sort of just scanning around looking for a pig and then something caught my eye so I had, I had a double take and looked back and it was about an 18 foot croc sliding into the water on that, that same dam so the dogs end up, my luck, getting a pit, good sized boar in there and uh, I wasn't hanging around, I was trying to drag it out as quick as I could so luckily didn't get eaten, dogs didn't get eaten and we got a good pig out of it so that's, uh, that's why. You gotta be careful up here when you're running dogs around this country because there's just crocs everywhere. Couple boars off the swamp for the hog hunt. Shot, Shot him. Got him in the dam before the croc ate the dogs. A bit toey, the dogs had one boar in the dam. I had to run in and grab him and pull him out. I thought big old croc might drag me in there, but we got away with it all good. <laughs> Laughing. Take him in Sunday and weigh him up. <laughs> What do we got here? Nice little stack of boars and one sow on the back here. Boar, boar, not a boar. Bull bag. <laughs> Getting into it. A couple of dogs had a few bust up, but nothing too bad. Got two off this little dam here. Primo. No dog. no dog, rest him up. 
Sharpshooter Cameron sealed the deal. Bit about the pig comp. We gotta gut the dog. Not happy, eh? Cutting a few balls up, gutting them out. Oh, they're really enjoying this shit. Well, there we are, lads. In for the weigh-in after the old porky bust-up. There's the other boys over here. Yeah, we've got a few right ones in the trailer. Not a bad weekend, eh, boys? There's the yarn sort of. Here's the other lads. What do you reckon? Good porky bust-up or what? Stinking. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. A bit smelly. Bit raw in the back. Three days in the trailer, what can you do? Bit of mobile rice getting around. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're crawling. Well, just got home from the Cooktown hog hunt. We didn't uh, didn't take out any wins, but we did get 19 pigs and had a ball doing it and got some cracker balls as well. So that's always good. And uh, got to make another another video with you guys. So hope you've enjoyed. Um, I'm gonna go and have a warm shower now and wash a bit of pig guts off me and go for a sleep since I haven't had a sleep for two days. And uh, I'll see you on the next video. Cheers.